Hello, and welcome back to Sword Art Online. Well, I ran to town, and I cleaned up those side quests, and I upgraded my weapons. And I got a couple skills for the side quests, but on the way back here to get this quest started, where we left off, that dragon actually came over to where I could attack it. And I learned a very valuable lesson. It's level 600, and I died. But hopefully we can use this and continue on our quest line. See what happens. Hopefully the dragon doesn't come down, because that was bad. Oh, it's one of these guys. Alright, cool. See how tough these guys are to kill. Oh, pretty tough, but as long as I dodge and block, it should be easy. And the boss is dead. Alright. Pretty simple. Congratulations, we're done. So, hopefully this will stop like the tornado right over there. Right down there. But, we'll just have to wait and see. Alright, it did stop the wind, so we can go down here now. Now we can see what is down here. Oh, there's a chest down there. That must be the key. Let's see. Here we are. It is another piece of the key. It is a key, period. Alright, so now we can go in that dungeon. Alright, sweet. Now we can go where we tried to start from last episode. Forgot where it is, it's down there. Alright, this should be pretty simple. I got a couple new spells too. If uh you'll be able to see them whenever I get in the dungeon here. And here we go. See, got a load of new spells, like this one makes it to where we can speed up, which is really helpful. Awesome, we just got a key. And now we can get in here, where the shamrock guys were just at. So, let's see if they're still in here. Something on the wall here. Let's pull it. Open the door. Alright, just keep going and see what we can do. These guys are 170. And they're pretty simple, but that big dragon was level 600 and... Did what I could, and I don't even think I put a dent in the health bar. So we'll get stronger, and then we'll come and kill that dragon. But I do plan on killing the dragon. These guys, these guys are pretty tough, but at least we can kill them. Shouldn't take too much. Ow! His friend from behind there. All right there we go. Do some magic. See if that'll help. I wonder what their weakness is. It looks like ice. Yeah, ice does like 250. If I saw correctly. Oh, god dang it. Killed it. And this is like for searching for treasure or something. Not entirely sure how it works. But hopefully it'll be useful in finding us stuff. I wonder. I'm gonna use it right here and see if it shows up on the map. No, it doesn't. Okay. I have no idea how it works. I'm going over here. Let's see if we can open this. Boss fight already. Okay. Cool. That was quick. Wasn't even expecting the boss fight to be there after we pulled two levers and we opened. Okay. Uh, we got a tougher version of the scorpion things. Right. I feel like we should be concerned. Please don't hit me. I'll have to kill you if that's the case. Alright. So I wonder if these guys are like dragons, if you could hit them on the underside, if it would actually do a lot of damage. But I guess we won't find out for a while. Oh, I wonder if you could hit the tail, actually. But that would require me having them focus on somebody else. But as soon as I come near them, they'll look at me. Oh, 
God. Okay, so that guy just started floating for no reason. Yeah, it doesn't look like hitting the tail does that much either. So this guy's going to be a little bit of a pain to kill. Wait, I wonder if I can hit him on the back. But he can hit me while I'm on his back. I feel like the stinger is a weak spot. It has to be. That's the only explanation. We can do that. That seemed to do a lot. Yeah, so we just kind of got to whittle him down with his armor. Because it doesn't look like we can do much else. Alright, we're almost done with this guy. We don't do too much damage to him because he's got the defenses like the rest of them, but I feel like if I could hit his tail, we could do something. Even if not, we almost have him dead. Oh great, he poisoned me. Ow, it did it again. Except it didn't apply poison this time. Well, that's him dead. So hopefully the item back here is what we need to stop the... What's it? What was it? The jet stream generator over near the boss main dungeon. Hopefully. That is going to start something else. Hey, look, the door opened. We're going to tell us that now. Yay, the door opened. Treasure. All right, what do we got? A piece of Geffen? It's another version of the key. I knew it. See, it's a key. And wha-bam. Key. Here we go. Alright, so... Now we should be able to go and un I swear to god, if it just teleported me out of the dungeon and isn't going to give me that treasure chest... It did. Oh, I'm a little upset. Alright. Well, so far so good, but I plan on hitting up that dungeon first. We'll be unable to use... Okay, so only us can run. That's fine. Leaf is going to be really weak, though. So, let's go and see about that dungeon. Just going to stop and see if there are any side quests in the town. But it doesn't look like there are any new quest lines available. Alright, let's see what we got. Oh hey, it's our friend from before. What's going on? Alright. And we gotta stop them from... Oh, we got harpies? I say they're harpies. Cockatrice. Cockatrice, whatever, however you want to pronounce it. Level 200? God. This is gonna be tough. Uh, apply this, and then we're gonna see if we can't do something about this. Let's see if we can't kill them real quick. This camera angle is really weird. Finally fixed it. But let's see if we can kill this guy. This thing is really tough. And it's quick, too. But it looks like it doesn't have that much health. We just gotta keep going and keep hitting on it. Alright, I got another buff up. I don't know what it is, but it looks like magic damage if I had to take my guess. Let's try some magic. And this thing ran away. 300 damage on dark damage? That's alright, I guess. But our sword skills do more. I think it was doing about a thousand. If I can actually use it, I almost have enough um, MP for it. We can go ahead and kill this boss. God, get away! I hit the auto lock sometimes because it starts hitting targets I wasn't even aiming at. But as soon as we get more for the sword skill again, we can probably kill this guy. Or girl, as the case may be. But we're almost done, and I have the sword skill, so... No, it wasn't a thousand, it was only six hundred, but that's still more than the dark damage was doing. Come here, you. Oh, the small ones are harpies, so I was right. Awesome. And now we get this person, probably. 
person stalking us from before. Alright, well then. I wonder if we're gonna be able to use them. Leprechaun. Alright, so that's weird. Okay. That's a new character, I guess? Yeah, so this character is probably a good player, and I think I'm gonna put him in the party if we can. Yep, he's found out, so let's see what's going on. So, pretty much, she's just a fan of Kirito. And Asuna, so I guess there's, she's just a fan of the group, and hopefully, hopefully we can um, use her in our party, because if we can't play with Yuki, we need somebody to put in the place, because Leaf is not exactly all that strong. Oh, it's rain, okay. So, this, a paradox of light and darkness. We got another quest line. This is pretty good. Oh, we're back in the real world, and Seven's on TV. Here we go. So... I guess that they're just giving news on Sword Art Online or something, so we'll just get back through this and get back into the game and possibly clear two more dungeons. I think I gotta do the one cave that was near the face of the mountain and then I probably get access to the main dungeon. Hopefully that's what it is. Let's see. First we have to get through all of this. And I think we just did. Here we are. Well, we're back in the game. I wonder if we get Yuki back. And if we can use Rain. Well. <laughs> what's going on here? I guess they're just talking about Rain now. But. We'll just have to wait and see what we can do after all this talk. Which is a lot of dialogue for this part of the game. I figured it would happen like after the main dungeon or something, not in between. Alright, there we go. Leafa has learned some more skills, and there's a side quest over here. Who is it for? It's for, um, Sil? No, it's not Silica. What was her name? I've forgotten her name, but we have three quests. But before we do any of those quests, I want to go back and do the, yeah, go back out to the main island and see if we can't figure out if we can do those dungeons or not. First, I'm going to check my party because I'm pretty sure it still has Leafa in my party. Yes, it does. Does this mean, yeah, here's Yuki. Where's Rain? Okay. Yes, Rain isn't available. Doesn't look like it. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. Alright, well, we have Yuki back, so that's the good part. So we have our strong team put back together. And I might work on leveling those others on the side after we defeat this main dungeon. Hopefully. Hopefully I don't have to fight that dragon. That's what I'm hoping. The thing was level 600 and it told me who was the boss. Kind of interesting, but I don't want to do it again. At least not now. Yeah, he migrated over here whenever I was flying to the last quest, and he just decided to teach me a lesson on why I don't want to fight him. Oh, god dang it. I ran out of stamina. I have to get used to not doing that. Or hitting R1 and other things without my swords out. And yeah, here we go. This is what I think we can do, and then we can go down into the other area, hopefully. See if this is what the key was working for. See, answer is the key works. Sweet. All right, now we can just go and kill. 
and hopefully get some decent weapons, because I do need to upgrade them if we're going to ever kill that dragon. Because I do want to kill him, because I'm pretty sure the EXP is going to be retarded, but his drops are going to be impressive. Something down here. Oh, it's another pad. Alright, so we'll probably have something up here we can use to activate the pad. And we shall see. There's treasure. Sweet. Dagger? I want to actually use a dagger character. I have to figure out who uses daggers and put them into our party at some point. Because they might actually be pretty good. God, I'm stuck. There we go. Yuki, where'd you come from? I thought you were behind me, not in front of me. These guys are 185. They're slightly ahead of us. But that shouldn't be too much of an issue. And they die pretty quickly either way. And they're all dead. Alright, here's the pressure pad that I was thinking we would find. And let's see if there's anything up ahead that we can find for loot. Probably find something of decent use. Yeah, we're level 156 and we're killing stuff that's 185. I might have to level up on the side at some point and see what we can get. Yeah, if this boss is level 200 or we start getting level 200 trash mobs, I'm just going to hit level 200 off cam and see what we can get. This is... no, it's not the boss room. It's locked by some mechanism, so we got to go and hunt for that. No loot. Nothing. Alright, let's see what we can find. Oh. Yuki has found another enemy to kill. And it's gonna be dead. Oh, I wasted my sword skill because she killed it as soon as I did use it. Yeah, all the trash mobs are 185, so we might start being under leveled shortly. Which will not go well for the boss fights. And that's not something I'm going to look forward to. Hey, this is activated. Isn't this where I came earlier? Let's see. Yeah, that has to be where I came from earlier because it looks just like the rest of the area. It's a massive circle. So, apparently the leprechaun can hide. Okay, some skills, huh? Alright, so gear can it give special skills. We need to find some of that if we can, because I want special skills. Or at least more than two sword skills. This door is locked, okay. Alright, if that door is locked, then where can we go? Because we had... We have to go way, I think. And then down here. Yes, I just saw that. I'll go back for it in a little bit. Oh, this is the start. Then what the heck? Where are we supposed to be going then? If that's the start, then I'm missing something. Down here and grab this and continue on and see what we can find. Because I am clearly missing something over here. Did I check this over here? Yeah, that's where those chests are. Then up here to the left would be where the pad is to activate the jet stream generator. And then we're, I'm missing something because there's two locked doors. I'm going to skip that and see if I can't figure out where I'm supposed to be headed to. Let's be out back here. Bingo. There we go. And now I can open this door, hopefully. Incorrect. It's the other door, so I have to run all the way around the arena. First, I'm killing these guys. Alright, now we got some buffs that look like it's for physical attack as well, instead of just magic. So... Actually, I'm going to check skills real quick because I haven't checked Asuna's or Yuki's to see if they have any useful things to add. Uh, could go ahead and add these. Add these. Oops. Oh well. I'll just put this one up here then. 
Oh my god, she has a lot of skills. Sea, ice, earth, that's fine, dark. Oh. Well, I didn't need to move that. Let's put this there. See if she has any battle skills. She has increased magic defense and probably one more. No, oh, a lot more actually. Status effects, improve critical, and see if there's any passives. Nope. Okay. Go to Yuki real quick, do the same, and then we'll continue back on our path. Uh, doesn't matter, doesn't matter. Let's see. Put that on. Put this on, because uh, we will need the resurrection if that dragon has taught me anything. And then. Put on lightning arrow. All right, cool. Now we're good to go again. Back to the middle of the arena. Or dungeon, should I say. I'm gonna go ahead and cast this as well. Let's see what we can find. Because we're almost to the door. And that means we get to find more stuff to do. Alright, gotta kill a couple of these things, which shouldn't be too, too hard. Oh, I'm stuck on one of them. I'm not too happy about that. Alright, these guys are almost dead. And after that, we'll be perfect. Because that door will open and probably give us a new key. Never mind, give us a lever to open up the other door. Same difference. Go ahead and cast this once more, and then run to the other side and probably fight the boss after we get up to level 2. Because second floor is probably where they're going to put the boss of this area, and then it should probably give us the final piece to stop the whirlwind coming out of the main boss dungeon of the overall island. Should be kind of awesome. Right, making good progress. Your enemies, Let's go ahead and kill them. Yeah, pretty simple. We got a rapier. Oh, look, it's more skeletons. These guys look crazy. And they are level 190, so boss is probably gonna be 200, like I was suspecting. Alright. Ow. That hurt. Oh, that has to be the freaking lightning arrow Asuna is using looks pretty cool, and if you notice, Yuki's actually using skills now that we have uh, given her the ability to. Alright, go ahead and kill these guys, and then work our way to the boss room. And we are done with these guys, but they seem to spawn really quickly. I may or may not have gotten turned around. No, I didn't, but I'm going to skip this. Kirito! What's going on? There we go. Now that he knows, he's just going to keep calling her out every time she follows us. I feel like at some point she's going to become a character we can use. Because if not, why would they keep showing... Uh, she keeps showing up around us. Or why would she even stalk us in the first place? And kill these guys, they're pretty simple. Alright, this guy's dead. Or should be. Guess not. I'm gonna go ahead and do that, and then I can go ahead and kill these two. Continue on our way. We're almost to the boss room if I have any idea where we are. Oh, there's another upstairs? Oh no, this is the way we came in. That kind of freaked me out. Alright, here we are. It was like three stages to a dungeon? I haven't seen this yet. Whoa! Um, this looks kind of crazy, so if I have any idea, we have to kill this guy first. And then we can do the rest. I think I'm gonna have to block that, because it doesn't look like I can dodge it. See what his weakness is. It's not ice. Dark does like 100. I did not mean to use that one, but I will use the swiftness. 
speed, whatever you want to call it. Okay, there we go. I can dodge now. I guess the increased speed allows me to dodge their skills. Unless I don't see them coming. Alright. He is really fast, so this is kind of scary. Oh, I blocked it. There we go. Yeah, we can kill this guy pretty quickly if we can get some hits on him. Or if the, my computer friends here help me. Oh, he dodged at the last second. No. Alright, let's see if I can block his next attack. He's going to dash backwards and then do that. Yeah, sweet. I'm getting the hang of this game now. I'm not completely terrible like I thought I was. I'm still bad. Blocking, but it just doesn't seem to be affecting. So let's see. Okay, he's not gonna hit me. That was weird. He's almost dead. Mid swing, can't block, of course. Happened again. Did you just die, buddy? You're almost dead. Like, why are you still fighting? Thank you. Now, this guy should be pretty easy. Or not even close. Probably gonna have to just spam him with magic. Yeah, it looks like he tweaked to magic. So, we'll go ahead and cast the quickness up and then just spam him out. I wonder if he's weak dice. No, he's not weak dice. Weak to stone? Figured he wasn't, but worth a shot. I wonder if Asuna's lightning arrow would be of any use. This is really hard to do whenever I can't even use my swords on him because it doesn't really affect him because he's a massive rock. But it looks like Yuki's doing reasonable damage. Actually, it looks like Asuna's frickin' lightning arrows are doing the work. He's almost dead, and after that, the door will open and we'll get another piece for... Who knows what it's going to be for, but it should just stop the... Jetstream generator coming out of the main boss fight, or boss dungeon, so we can get in there and fight the one for the island. She, her lightning arrow hit level 10, so it's like we're getting some use out of it. Alright, let's see what we get. I'm glad, nope, it's going to tell me that it's opened. Oh, what is that? Uh, that's weird. Alright, so we got something we don't know. Cauldron. And an escape crystal. Sweet. I don't have to be in here any longer than I am. Escape crystal. Alright. Get us out of here. Sweet. That went off without a hitch. And that was pretty fun to do. Hopefully that dragon doesn't come to try and kill us. But I thank you all for